Hey, it's um, end of November in 2022. The sun's just going down, so I hope our light keeps it good for us. We're just going for a walk along the dam. Uh, it's about seven o'clock in the evening. And we got here, and I, I said to her, listen, look at this. And you can see a goanna track through here. We've seen a, we've seen a big goanna here, over a metre, up, up in, this, in this dead tree. So you can maybe be able to see through the, through the revegetation. And you can tell it's a goanna because here's, here's where its tail has just wobbled a little bit. A, a snake does a, a more of a, a curve, but a goanna just drags his tail. And you can see right along here, it's just dragging, dragging the tail along. If I was better, I'd be able to show you there'd be, there'd, there'd be claw marks there somewhere, but I'm just not good enough to identify them. He's come through here, around there, he's come around here, there, and, oh, that could be a, his footprint through there, and that could be one there as well, so he's gone around the corner a bit here. Fascinating stuff. Goannas are a, one of our higher order predators, and they indicate the health of our ecosystem, which is what, what we really want to do, and it's, it's what's really important to us. We've, um, we've seen goannas climbing around the trees, poking their heads in the hollows of the trees. And what they're doing, they're, they're looking for a feed. They're looking for baby birds and eggs, because that's what they eat. So if we have goannas, that means there's enough baby birds and eggs to make the goanna survive. And that means there's enough birds to produce the, the baby birds and eggs and reproduce the birds as well. So it's just a great, great system. And the, if we've got that many birds, that means We've got a lot of insects for the birds to eat, to lay the eggs, so there's enough eggs for the environment and the goannas and the goannas. Are there. So the goanna here is, would be about this big because we've seen him. It's just absolutely marvellous. Jared, can you just walk along that track so I can show it to everyone because it's quite long and it's hard to get on camera. I, I'm thinking it's finishing here, but I don't know. Here it is. If I see any more track marks, I'll point them out. But see, this is a bit sandy and gravelly, and I'm just not experienced. I can see a little little toes poking in there. So that's why I think he's going that way. And here he comes through here, I think. you just got to keep your eyes out. And, and for us... This is, this is where we get um, a lot of reward for, um, for our efforts, just enjoying what's, knowing what's happening. Anyway, I hope that makes sense. Sometimes we rush these things, but um, enjoy it and we'll see you in the next video.